Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to test for a cylinder head leak or a block leak or a bad head gasket, warped head or warped cylinder block, even a cracked sleeve. And what we're going to be using today is a leak tester. Uh, it goes in your radiator. It's a combustion leak indicating fluid. That's what's in this bottle right here. It's a blue liquid. And what you do is you pour it in this, they come apart. There are two different chambers. You pour a little fluid in here, put the seal back on, you pour more fluid in here, and then you squeeze it after you put it in your radiator, and the color will change on the fluid. Your first prep is going to be to take the radiator cap off. Now that you have the radiator cap off, you're going to drain your radiator fluid at least four inches below the radiator. Now that we've drained the radiator fluid, we're gonna take our turkey baster look-alike and we're gonna fill it. I've already filled this one right here with the blue liquid. And we're gonna take our combustion leak indicating fluid, which is the blue liquid, and we're gonna fill it up. We're gonna set it on top of the radiator cap. And then we're gonna pump it 15 times. And if the blue changes the yellow, we have a bed head gasket if it doesn't change, then we don't have a bad head gasket. We just want to make sure our radiator fluid isn't coming up, because if you get radiator fluid and a freeze in here, it'll change the color anyway. So you don't want any radiator fluid getting up in here. So we're going to go ahead and pump it about 15 times. it 15 times and it's still blue so this would mean that we do not have a blown head gasket or a leak 